All right, here we go with a detailed look at 11 with Agos. This is the Target exclusive, and I like it. It's pretty awesome. A little bit disappointed now that it's out of the box because I see a lot of flaws, which we'll get into in just a second. So getting up close on 11, I like the whole outfit and the socks, the little bloody nose, the ego. It looks awesome, but the paint is not very great, I must say. Like, if you see up, I like the forehead and over there, and even on the side right here, like right up there by the hair, it just really sucks. And then on the back really sucks also. Look at that, man. So it's pretty crappy. I'm, I may even return this one, to be honest with you. Uh, I don't like when it's this bad. I mean, even on the back by the jacket, it's terrible. They did a terrible job on this one. Definitely. So, you know, if you're going to get this, I really recommend you make sure you, like, look at it thoroughly. Maybe even take it out of the box at Target to look at it. Like, look at the hair even over here. It is so jacked up on the hair right there. It's all, like, bubbled up. So, I mean, this got to get a thumbs down as far as a review. Don't thumbs down the video, though. Give it a thumbs up for my honesty. <laughs> But I don't recommend this pop because of the paint. I mean, it's really bad. Probably one of the worst I've seen. A lot of the 8-bits have terrible paint jobs to them. Like, for example, this Batman exclusive. Really, really bad paint. So, you know, this one, not too good. Thanks for watching today's video. Please hit that thumbs up button if you enjoyed these kind of videos. Subscribe if you're new. Hit the bell so you're notified as soon as I have a new video up. You'll be one of the first to watch. And stay tuned for the new giveaway. Leave a comment. Let me know your favorite Funko Pop from Stranger Things so far this year. I'd love to know. Much love. We out.